The science of nuclear forensics helps trace lost or stolen radioactive material and so can deter smuggling and terrorism. Radioactive material is widely used in energy, medicine and industry. But if it gets into the wrong hands, it can cause serious harm. We know that illicit trafficking or smuggling of nuclear or other radioactive materials is an existing problem all over the world. If there is a strong nuclear forensic science in a country, it can have a deterrence effect against terrorism and also can help very effectively the legal process and the investigator authorities. When any suspected radioactive material is discovered, for example at a border crossing or in a police raid, it's time to call in the nuclear forensic experts. The experts carefully gather and analyze evidence for use in a potential criminal investigation or court case. It is critical that no mistake is made that could compromise an investigation. The priority is to determine what the seized material is and what threat it poses. The scientists analyze the samples using a variety of techniques including chemical and isotopic measurements. We have to answer questions like what kind of material we have, is it radioactive, if yes, who is responsible for this material, who would be the owner. The investigator is uh, most of the cases interested also in the origin of the material, which can help the legal process. To answer these questions, the sample can be compared to other radioactive material known to be in the country. This helps investigators track where the seized material came from. Nuclear forensic scientists work closely with police to trace the material, find the perpetrators and help solve the crime. Nuclear forensics uses science to meet serious needs in criminal prosecution and nuclear security. It's recognized globally as an emerging tool to help states address serious threats. The IAEA helps countries strengthen their nuclear forensic capacity through training and technical expertise.